quit job and vowed to cancel Archetypes Season 2 shows deep regret for making a deal with Meghan. Prince Harry and Meghan Markle signed a multi-million dollar deal with Spotify back in 2020. The boss at Spotify, who helped sign the Duke and Duchess of Sussex, has reportedly quit the platform as a number of job cuts hit the company. Glad that this means there'll be no Archetypes Season 2, hopefully Netflix will see the writing on the wall as well. According to Chief Executive Daniel Ek, Dawn Ostroff, who's the streaming company's chief content and advertising officer, has decided to depart Spotify. The news of Miss Ostroff's exit comes as the Stockholm headquartered company confirmed that around 600 people would be losing their jobs. In a blog post, Mr. Elk wrote, In hindsight, I was too ambitious in investing ahead of our revenue growth. Dawn Ostroff said she regrets some of the key decisions made in 2022, noting that it lost more than it gained with the huge investments of the past year. Because of her own lack of insight, Dawn Ostroff made nearly 20 employees decide to quit during a recent failed project operation. Miss Ostroff was responsible for the streaming services investment in podcasting. Surely with what Dawn Ostroff shared above, you can also guess that Megan's project is the only reason why she had to quit. Also, with the end of archetypes, the media at that time kept reporting the leaving of long-time employees and archetypes only received negative comments for a long period of time. She signed up the Duke and Duchess of Sussex's Archetypes series in a deal with the couple's production business, Archwell Audio. Miss Ostroff's departure from Spotify is probably only tangentially related to the fact that she signed the deal with the Markles. If the company is laying off 600 employees and a management shakeup, they've got systematic issues, and it's just part of what's happening in tech these days. Alphabet, Google's parent, is laying off 12,000 employees. The Sussexes had zero original ideas or creativity. Just Royal and the wife. What a complete waste. I guess I'm glad their work has outed them as wannabes with no real talent. There should have been some sort of gatekeeping though. I guess who would have thought that they'd have absolutely nothing to offer? As well as this, she also oversaw an exclusive tie-up to bring popular comedian and podcast host Joe Rogan to the platform. Spotify has spent an estimated $1 billion on exclusivity deals and acquisitions, including production company Gimlet, all with Miss Ostroff's guidance. However, amid mounting losses, investors have started to question the cost of the strategy. On Monday, the restructuring will see Ms. Ostroff's role merged into the role of Chief Business Officer. Speaking of the decision, Mr. X said the move would ensure efficiency, cost controls and speed up decision making. Meghan and Harry signed the deal just months after they announced that they were set to step down as senior working royals.